Take a moment, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And see yourself sitting here within your house. And we're going to reach down and grow roots out of the bottom of our feet. We're going to reach down through the floor, through the basement. And we're going to reach down to the earth far below our houses, through the soil, around the rocks, until we get down and reach the bedrock far below where we are. And as we hit that bedrock, we'll search around till we can find the cool, clear waters of energy far beneath the earth. Waters of chaos, waters of potential. And we're going to suck these waters up through our roots with each and every breath, bring them further and further into our feet and into our legs. Each and every breath brings them further into our bodies, into our loins, into our bellies. Next breath brings them up into our chests and into our heads. And each breath after brings the waters up through our bodies, out our heads, out our hands, and back into the ground. Waters flowing throughout our bodies, filling us with this energy of potential from below. The cool waters take this energy, grab it, take all that you need out of it and bring it into yourselves. Enjoy it, revel in it. Now, we're going to reach up into the sky, up through the ceilings and through our roofs, up through the clouds and into the skies, searching for that star directly above our heads. We're going to reach up and we're going to pull down the light, pull down the fire of order from above, bring it down, down into our hands and into our heads. With each breath, we pull this fire down into our bodies, mixing it with the waters into our chest. Bring it down into our bellies and our loins. With each and every breath, we bring it down further into our legs and into our feet. We're pulling the fires from above and the waters from below, order and chaos, mixing throughout our bodies, filling us with these energies if you look at yourselves, you'd see yourselves glowing, the waters flowing with the fire within them. Take of these energies all that you need. Fill your reserves. But take only what you need. Don't take too much. Don't take too little. And now, go push the waters back down to the ground. We'll push the fires back up into the sky and disconnect from both, holding on to all that we need. Then know that if you ever need to pull these energies again, you can always reach down, you can always reach up. But for now, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And when you're ready, open your eyes and join us for magic. Our first offerings go to the Earth Mother. Mighty Earth Mother, you surround us, you support us, you aid us, you give us food, you give us shelter. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, Accept our offerings. Spirit, accept our offerings. Now, we're here to honor the gods, the land spirits, and the ancestors. We're here to ask for blessings from all the kindred. But first, we hallow our hallows. Mighty well, you reach deep into the earth, to the land of the ancestors. We ask you to be our connection to the underworld, 
we give you the silver and say, sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters flow within us. Mighty fire, you burn and you transform. You take our offerings high into the sky, into the heavens. We offer you this incense. Oh yes, yeah, sacred fires burn within us. Sacred fires burn within us. And mighty tree, your roots go deep into the earth, to the lands of the ancestors. Your branches go high in the sky to the lands of the shining ones. We give you incense and we give you waters. We say, sacred tree, grow within us. Sacred tree, grow within us. In my grove and in all of our groves, by the might of the water, the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. So be it. Now we call on the gatekeepers. Gatekeepers all, you who have aided us in the past. We call on you once more to open the ways between the worlds. Aid us in our work this evening. Watch over us as we do our works. Guide us and guard us as we walk your holy ways. We ask that you take our messages far and wide, that you bring back to us all that we need to hear. Mighty gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, join your magic with mine. In my grove and in all of our groves, let the well open as a gate to the underworld. Let the fires open as a gate to the upper worlds. Let the tree be the crossroads between all the worlds open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. Now we make offerings to the kindred. First, we call on the shining ones. Gods and goddesses of other days, you who look over each and every one of us, our matrons, our patrons, we offer you welcome. To those of you that are of this very earth where each and every one of us lives, we offer you welcome. To all of you, be you unknown to us or known to us, that watch over us, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fire. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Now we call to the land spirits. You have fur and feather, scale and skin. All of our animal kin, we offer you welcome. To leaf and stem, branch and twig. To all of our plant kin, we offer you welcome. And to all the unseen, our house spirits, the fae, hold folk, and what other Whatever other names you desire to go by, we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fire. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land spirits, accept our offerings. I call to the ancestors, to each and every one of you of our family, our lineage, we offer you welcome. To all of those that we look at as mentors and inspiration, our chosen family, we offer you welcome. And to all of those of this very earth that are here with us, we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fire. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, accept our offerings. 
And at this moment, if you have offerings of your own that you wish to make, please feel free to make them. wisdom and what is best prevail. If there are no further offerings to be made, mighty kindred, we give to you, we give to you one last time as a whole, we ask, mighty kindred, Accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. And now, mighty kindred, we have given to you, so we ask, what blessings do we receive? Shining one, what blessings do you give us? Give us kanas, the spark, inspiration. And land spirits, what blessings do you give us? You give us nowsies, the need fire. And ancestors, what blessings do you give us? They give us Burkano. Birch in new beginnings. They're giving us the inspiration we need to bring about needed new beginnings. I think this is a good omen. Do we accept this omen? We accept this omen. Okay. Mighty Kindred. We have given to you that you have returned with these beautiful omens. We ask that you fill these waters in each and every one of our cups. Fill them with the omens we have just heard. Fill them with kanas and a spark of inspiration. Fill them with nabzis and the need fire, the desire to get things done. Fill them with burkano and new beginnings. And we have the spark of inspiration to bring about new beginnings throughout our lives. Behold the waters of life, and behold them in each and every one of our mugs. Behold the waters of life. At this point, let's thank all of those who have aided us. Ancestors, be you our family, be you our chosen family, or be you of this very place for all that you do for us throughout our days and throughout this rite. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, we thank you. <sighs> to the land spirits, be you animal kin, plant kin, or the unseen kin. Again, for all that you do for us throughout our days and all you've done for us throughout this rite. Land spirits, we thank you. Land spirits, we thank you. And to the shining ones, be you our patrons and matrons, be you of this very land, or be you unknown to us. For all that you do throughout our days and all you've done for us in our rites. Shining ones, we thank you. Shining ones, we thank you. And gatekeepers, all you have aided us once more, you have opened the ways, and you've allowed us to get these beautiful omens back for all that you've done for us in this rite and all you've done for us throughout the years. Gatekeepers, we thank you. Gatekeepers, we thank you. Now we ask you once more to join your magic with mine in my house and in all of our houses. Let the well become but water once more. Let the fires become but flames once more. 
let the tree become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. Let the gates be closed. And Earth Mother, we call on you first and we honor you last. For without you, we would not be here. You hold this special place in all of our hearts. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth Spirit, we thank you. Then go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace. This rite has ended.